To be fair, you have to have a very high IQ to understand Rick and Morty. Humor is extremely subtle, and without a solid grasp of theoretical physics, most of the jokes will go over a typical viewer's head. There's also Rick's nihilistic outlook, which is deftly woven into his characterization. His personal philosophy draws heavily from Narodnia Volia literature, for instance. The fans understand this stuff. They have the intellectual capacity to truly appreciate the depths of these jokes, to realize that they're not just funny, they'd say something deep about laugh. As a consequence, people who dislike Rick and Morty truly are idiots. Of course, they wouldn't appreciate, for instance, the humor in Rick's existential catchphrase, Wubba Lubba Dub Dub, which itself is a cryptic reference to Torganiv's Russian epic fathers and sons. I'm smirking right now, just imagining one of those adult-pated simpletons scratching their heads in confusion as Dan Harmon's genius wit unfolds itself on their television screens. What fools, oh, I pity them. And yes, by the way, I do have a Rick and Morty tattoo, and you cannot see it. It's for the ladies' eyes only, and even then they have to demonstrate that they're within five AQ points of my own, preferably lower, beforehand. Nothing personal, kid.